We welcome you back to Twins Live, presented by CenturyLink. We're here in Mall of America's studio, joined by Dana Kicker, the pride of Sleepy Eye, Minnesota, former Red Sox pitcher and now an analyst, TV analyst with the uh, St. Paul Saints, and Sean Aronson, the, uh, his broadcast partner and the media relations director and broadcast director as well for the Saints. Guys, welcome so much today, and we're here to talk about a very exciting event, the 2016 American Association All-Star game hosted by the Saints and we're excited to be televising that event August 2nd. Sean tell us a little bit about the excitement the fact the Saints are so well represented. Yeah this is huge not only for the Saints but for CHS Field the award-winning ballpark uh, you know that we opened up last year. This is a chance for uh, guys in this league to showcase their talents. Uh, there'll be a number of scouts out there. Uh, it's almost a, a second chance league for a lot of these guys. They were an affiliated ball uh, a couple of them were in the big leagues. Obviously, we've got Caleb Thielbar, who pitched for the Minnesota Twins. Um, and so this is the opportunity for these All-Stars to get their chance to showcase their talents and hopefully vault themselves to an organization. What kind of talent might we see at this All-Star game coming up next month, Dan? Uh, um, some of the best in minor league baseball, and I get that question quite often, Tom, you know, is, is independent baseball, is it A ball, is it double A, is it triple A, and it kind of depends upon the night, but you're going to see, you're going to see players probably at the triple A or even the major league level, for instance, uh, Mark Hamburger, a, a local product, hopefully he'll be the starting pitcher if the rotation uh, um, sets up properly for him, but uh, somebody that's getting it up there about 90, 91, he might hit 93 once in a while. Um, you're going to see guys that have a chance to maybe make it to the major league someday. John, the Saints have uh, hosted the All-Star Game before. There's always some interesting ancillary events that go on. What can fans expect that night. Yeah, no doubt. I mean, we're, we're pulling out for two days. So Monday night, uh, Home Run Derby. Uh, we're going to have a, a couple of musical acts with the Chris Hockey Band and Soul Asylum. Uh, we're also going to have a celebrity softball game out there. Uh, and then on Tuesday, it really is, it's, it's for the fans and for the players. We want the players to interact uh, with the fans, but it's, it's 48 hours of, of nonstop fun for 